Uh, this is also making the rounds. You know, why is this not featured? Uh, da, da, da. It's not featured. It should be featured. I can't spell that guy's name though. Chugga Conroy uses YouTuber Chugga Conroy of cheating on his girlfriend for tranny feet RP. That kind of spoils the uh, the news, I guess, me typing it out like that. But that is accurate. Lady Emily, who is a man. Here you go. Here's the here's the lovely lady. Um, he accused Chugga Conroy, this guy, of uh, soliciting the feet pics from him. He says. He says, I say, ambitiously, audaciously opening attachments on the Kiwi Farms. Uh, fuck it, just to get it off my chest, last year Chugga Conroy kept trying to get me to initiate erotic foot fetish roleplay with him while he had a girlfriend. This included sending shoes to my house under the guise of a gift, only to constantly ask for feet pics afterwards. Uh, eventually... I started ignoring him because I wasn't sure of how to navigate around him, clearly trying to rope me into his fetish shit and then return messages to me get more and more frequent and aggressive. And as far as I know, I'm not the only nor the first person he's done this to. He would try to assure me everything is fine while also clearly trying to initiate fetish italicized text RP. It started with me or with him attending my Pokemon Black streams last December and chatting. We started talking in DMs because he seemed chilled, and on June 4th I uploaded a selfie, and he zoomed into my shoes in the background and messaged me about them. <laughs> it, okay, chat. It's time for a good old-fashioned Polarino. Paul, is it worse to be a tranny chaser or a foot fat? Question mark. Tranny Chaser Foot Fag. Vote now. Vote one for Tranny Chaser. Vote two for Foot Fag. It's a very risky poll. I'm using bad words on it, chat. I'm waiting for the first results. We have our first votes coming in now as chat catches up with the live stream. Gonna wait for 100 as per usual, but 50 participants in. 95% of people say tranny chaser. Uh, and with 100 votes in, it's uh, only down to 92%. So my community, overwhelmingly, 10 to 100 say uh, that uh, being a tranny chaser is far, 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 far worse than being a foot fag. I'm actually a little bit surprised at that. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I figured that foot 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 fags would get a little bit more hate than that. Oh, yeah, fucking ninety percent of people. I I mean I thought that a train chaser would win. I just didn't think it would win. You know, ninety percent. All right. Uh, I do have the DMs that he posts as well. Reload all these. All right. Check a Conroy. This is. June 11th, 2023. So I originally planned to go with black with a floral pattern, but they laced it to your size. So I went with what I thought was most likely to go with any clothes. Uh, the tranny says, Ooh, great call because I love high tops, but haven't had any in years and years. Chugga says, ha ha is my favorite personal favorite shoe. It's a great shoe. It goes with everything. Chugga says, do I, do I, Get to see even uh what is the reply to this i guess he doesn't get a reply to that chugga says haha thank you trying to get a lot done this is months later so i guess uh the tranny was very careful to make sure that none of the uh back and forth after this message was recorded and then posted because that would just make it seem like he was leading the other guy on uh, only to complain a year later, like a full year later, uh, that he was being sexually uh, explicit without any re reciprocation. Because uh, if the answer to this question was no, I imagine that that would be included into this. Haha, <laughs> thank you. 
trying to get a lot done. I want to finish the series or at least get close so I can travel to Scotland to see my significant other soon. Oh, cool. I didn't realize she was in Scotland. Yes, pretty far, but we're thinking of immigration next year. Would you like to pick up where we left off last night? <laughs> it dropped off suddenly. Oh, I guess he didn't reply to this. I'm like, no, this is three months later. So whatever the fuck was the response to this is being omitted from the record, being struck in from the record, being uh, not not adequately divulged to the Kiwi Farms as a consequence, okay? Uh, he says, you tend to disappear. Oh, going to ping you once more. This is uh, two hours after the last message. And then this is the next day. Well, hello. Have a nice doctor's visit. Sorry to ping you again. Just wanted to know. Damn, you're no fun. Kidding, kidding. Just a little concern. I missed you. Are you doing better? Blah. Blargan. Hey, I like this guy because it's like, do I get to see you in them? Did you have a nice doctor's visit? Uh, hope we can pick up where we left off uh, yesterday. You know, fun, just kidding. Like, he thinks none of that works, right? So what does he think will work? He's, he's trying to solve this Rubik's Cube of social interaction. How do I get this tranny to show me his disgusting man feet? Ah, I got it. Bargain. I just the response to this is like, haha, you're so random. Haha, here are my feet pics. Like, that's what he thinks is going to happen as a response to this. This is autism. Um, hey, hope I'm not piling it on. Just saw you were on. Hello. Oh, no, the green dot. <laughs> the green dot showed up on Discord. Hey, hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. How you doing? <laughs> got any, uh, feet pics? <laughs> you, got, you got any cozy woesies to show me today, buddy? <laughs> I saw your dot was green today. Usually you're offline these days. I don't know what, what happened. I guess you just stopped using Discord in the last week. I can't help but notice you're offline a lot of the time. <laughs> Sorry, that was uh, rude of me. I shouldn't say stuff like that, even jokingly. You have your own stuff going on as much as I do. Hey, hey. Sorry, I'm bugging you so much. I'm just getting done with work and saw you hadn't heard back. Hey, yo. How's today? Feeling any better? Hi, sorry if I'm bugging you. Hope I understand you got your own stuff going on. Just wanted to wish you well tonight after seeing you talk about uh, how much being sick set you back. I really enjoyed talking to you more than I thought. I'll leave you after this message in case you need the rest. Um, so This is back in September at some point. That's what I thought too, lol. Like I could fix this, but it'd be funnier if it's flawed. At times I do miss the versatility of the old avatar. It was fun to mess with. Is that the face you'd make if I ran off with your shoes at a con? Lamau, something like that. Ha <laughs> ha, what would you do? <laughs> um, that face. I mean, I guess the it's supposed to be this face. Like this right here. Like, oh, you'd make that face if I ran off with your with your shoes? Cool. Uh, yeah, being forward with you because I'd rather not keep anything from you, let you make the best decision for you. I am into that, but only with my significant other. I also like talking about shoes with people because it's also an interest. I just talked to my significant other about this when we started dating, and she told me we can talk about shoes with other people because it isn't sexual with my friends. It's just something I enjoy talking about with my friends, too. I know there might be a lot to share, and I'm sorry it is, but I feel it's best just to be open with people and consider... What I'd like to know if I was in their position. Good. Glad. We, it really is telling how he omits so much of this conversation. Good. Glad we understand each other. Walks walks up behind you and trips you with some fancy footwork. You thud to the ground and I yank your sneakers off in an instant. Ha ha. Loser. And chucks them at you. Wow. What a great role play. Okay. I'm going to role play that I'm going to trip you and then call you a loser and then take your shoes off. And then also after I'm done smelling them, I'm going to throw them at you. Also... Ooh, I'm going to save it. <laughs> I'm going to save that for the, the outro song. He, he triggered a memory of mine. Uh, Lady Emily says, last selfie plus on repeat. There's one song I'm ashamed to have in here. It's probably not the one you're thinking of. Um, cool. Also, I really appreciate how in this picture, you can see if you look at that thumbnail, like his giant potato head. 
and then how much he has to hide of his face <laughs> like as a consequence like well i don't want to show that enormous man jaw that i have and my enormous chin so let me just cover half my face yeah once you cover about like a half my face and you get it in this very specific angle from above i kind of do look a little bit feminine huh uh, check it says nice sneakers. Oh, well, thank you. I need new ones to be honest. He's a uh, dude. Come on. He, okay. So this is the conversation logs from up here. And then he says, I need new ones to be honest. My everyday pair is starting to see some damage. And then, uh, he says, Sally, typical due to thin fabric, uh, curse of liking shoes that aren't durable. Get them on sale over $20. Can't complain. Hope you're doing well. It's not blah, blah, blah. I mean, if he knows that he's a foot fetishist and he's going to send you shoes, saying that I need new shoes is like an invitation. I don't know. Maybe this is before he made it clear that he's like a foot fetishist and uh, he didn't realize that saying that I need new shoes would be like an invitation for this. Um, I don't know how many I have for full stamina bar and level. I can see it on the loading stream. According to this, I've done 54. Um, I don't know what any of this is about. You have a P.O. box, not at the moment. Oh, well, I was going to see if I could partake in birthday niceness and send them shoes. Okay, cool. Creepy. It's a man addicted to, to tranny feet. I want, there's someone, I swear, there's someone on the top of my head. Or like an, as a distant memory that was also really into tranny feet. It's like a burning, searing memory, like a hole in my head. I know for sure... There is someone specifically into tranny feet. He might have even been a forum member. And I just can't remember who it is. Oh, it's, it's killing me. Does anyone know who I'm talking about? Flamenco, Brian Dunn. It was Rye Wrangler. I could believe that. No, I need to know who it was into tranny feet. Was it? <laughs> no. I'm having another chimp burgers. No, it wasn't chimp burgers, I don't think. It's not flamenco. It's not me. It's not Beardson. Tipster. That's a good guess. I don't think any of it. Sneasel is a good guess, too. It could be Sneasel. I don't know if it was Sneasel. Sneasel was into diapers, though. He wasn't into feet. I always thought the diaper thing was a joke. Apparently, it was not a joke. It could be feet. It could be Sneasel. I could be thinking of Sneasel. I'm not sure, though. Yeah, no, he was into dipes. Dipe dipes. That's what we would call them, dipe dipes. I don't know why I didn't pick up that that was not a joke. I just didn't figure that anyone was actually into trannies and diapers, but... Uh, some people are. Thank you for watching this clip by Colonel J. This is the King of Bold here. Remember to like and subscribe. Juice!